Hey everybody, welcome to the channel, Rockin' the Country. I'm Don. Hope you're having a good day. Hope you're having a good life. But there are some bumps along the road, as we know. But uh, I don't know why that just popped into my mind, but that just did. I'm doing a reaction to an artist I hadn't heard of, hadn't heard the song. It's a true reaction, which is mostly what I do. But this is Pat Green's song, Wave on Wave. And I don't discern any meaning from that, you know? Um, so I got to listen to the song. But Pat Green is from San Antone, or we would say San Antonio, Texas. But I know you all would say it's San Antone. I'm sure the Emswathers are going to have thoughts on that, and Texas Magnolia and others. But, um, oh, Pat Green went to Texas Tech. Texas Tech, who are they? The Red, are they the Red Raiders? I think they're the Red Raiders, Texas Tech. Maybe I'm getting that wrong, but maybe some of you guys uh, are, uh, you know, alumni or fans, but um, chime in. But this was requested by Sarah Emily, and it was in honor of a high school friend of yours. So, you know, what did you say about the friend? Did you, did you say she, like, had a really bad... She had a bad car accident, but recovered and went on to become a mother. I think you said she went on to become a mother. So, but I don't think you left any other information as far as I'm re recollecting. But let's see here. Pat Green was nominated for some Grammys in the early 2000s. So, you know this is going to be good because you don't get nominated for a Grammy without being good. So, we're going to see... Just what that means. All right, Pat Green's song, Wave on Wave. Here we go. All right, friends. So here's how I'm going to introduce our first live performance. Pat Green, Wave on Wave. You're very welcome. Very cool. I think cool. it would be stupid not to do Wave on Wave. I mean, I mean, what a blessing, you know, kind of thing in life. To, here's a 10-year-old song that... You know, it's still the last song we play every night. Yeah, I mean, it's been on The Voice, it's been on American Idol, it's been on all these, it's been in movies. It, you know, it's just one of those career songs that you, I, mean, I, didn't, I didn't know it was gonna happen to me, but it changed everything about my, every aspect of my life um, happened because of that song. Wow. To have longevity, 20 years playing music and have a song like that that keeps, just keeps going. I, yeah, I'm, I'm just floored. That's so cool. Bottom of my mind, I got no direction. We're all playing the same game. All looking for redemption. Just afraid to say the name So God, I'm now in pretending What we're seeking is the truth I'm just looking for a happier name All I'm looking for is you Nice love song.
All right, Sir Emily, because you requested this in honor of your friend, what's going through my mind now, and I don't want to forget it at the end, is just that now because this is you're the you know the song is you're the reason I'm still here. I don't know if you were that close to this high school friend that you, Sir Emily, are the reason she's still here. Um, maybe that's where you're coming from on this because it's a wonderful thing if you happen to be that person that keeps someone else going, you know? I mean, what else are friends, you know? Like family, supposed to do that, but friends, definitely, that's we choose one another and we stay in there with them. I don't know if that's what it is, but obviously you could comment. Or not, if that's too personal, forgive me, but um, that's what just came to mind listening to the song. Here we go. That Pat Green seems like a pretty cool dude, I gotta say. He seems like a really, really nice guy. You can see in the end, he was just loving being part of it. He didn't seem uppity at all, like, I'm all of that. And even in the beginning, he said that one, this one song changed his life in so many ways. So he just seems like a good, down-to-earth dude. Um, so... Yeah, Sarah Emily, you could, you know, I left my comment about you, but here's how I'm going to rate this in two different ways. It's to me, it was a simple song and it changes life. And I'm happy for that for, for him. Anytime something happens in that good way for somebody. Uh, I love that. I love seeing people succeed, you know, especially if it was a dream of them and it wasn't an accidental success, which it rarely is, um, like winning the lottery or whatever. But I like seeing this. The song to me was a simple song. It was, you know, you're the reason I'm still here. That's a very simple concept. It's a beautiful concept. I'm going to rate this in two ways. One, the song itself, I'm giving an 8.0. The heart behind it and that this means so much to you, Sarah Emily, and the fact that your friend made it through an accident, I'm giving that a 10.0. That heart, that desire that you would even think to request this in honor of your friend, maybe she'll see this. And um, you know, and she's got kids and that life changed. But um, you know, I had a friend who was in a car wreck and he didn't make it through it, my friend Ricky. And I got that phone call. I was a freshman in college. I got the phone call and he and my younger sister called me and that was a really, really crappy phone call, and I still miss him. And it's 40 years later, almost, anyway. But I'm glad for your friend, Sarah Emily. You obviously are. <laughs> and, um, and if you're the reason she made it through, or possibly her fight showed you how to fight through the things in your life, I don't even know. But that poignancy, that beauty right there, you get a 10.0 because that is seriously beautiful stuff. So that's my two-part answer and reading to this song. And Pat Green seems like a good dude. I'm happy for his success. So there it is, guys. 
All right, leave your comments, like and subscribe. Love to see the family grow and we'll keep doing our thing. All right, guys, have a great day. See you in another video. Keep rocking the country.